some stage. Uh, at you know, some stage down the line, I would have absolutely no problem with doing a Let's Play of it. But um, I do believe Naughty Dog is the biggest fan of Let's Plays. Uh, I know Day9, among others, have done Let's Plays, but I'm not Day9. They might, he might be, you know, an exception because big name. I'm little pal and I, little Philip. It would be a bit different. Like, nothing against the guy, that's probably just had the case. If what I'm hearing is true. I'm hearing that Naughty Dog is in a final last place. I have to look into it myself, though. I'm just... That's just, like, if that's the case, then that's why others have been able to do it. That's just an explanation for that. It's also possible that he just didn't give a shit and did it, you know, did his own thing. Like, uh, I'm sure a lot of people do with uh, some restrictions. Um, empowered as Kinsley. Let's kill you first. Um... I am no beast yeah. of London. But, um, like, you know, with Warner Brothers games, any game published by Warner Brothers, you actually can't do a Let's Play of. Well, you can, but each episode must be five minutes or less if it has any gameplay in it. So it's not exactly Let's Playable. Ooh, this is nice. Um, so it's not Let's Playable, which is why, I, I, like, even though I have to fear games, all one, two, three, I won't be doing them at all. Ever. Unless Warner Brothers change their policy, and I don't see that happening. I remember hearing about Warner Brothers suing themselves, issuing a cease and uh, copyright claim against their own website. I don't see them changing, you know, like easing up on their copyright stuff anytime soon. When before I do a let's play of any game, I check to make sure it's less playable. I send them emails, and if I don't get a response, I may try a few more times, try a different email. But I don't go and let's play it, so I I want to keep my channel intact. So that's why. So if so I won't be doing Warner Brothers games. I'm thinking about trying some, some Sega stuff. I have a Total War thing done, but that's because I've actually got particular permission for, for to do that. They, the, the people doing Total War have no problem with Let's Plays, but any other Sega thing, I'm ner nervous of. They've had some bad history. TB did a boycott for five years, uh, th and that's why I've been nervous of doing it. Look up to TB boycott. Um, if you want to know why. Uh, but yeah, I've been nervous because I don't want to lose my channel. So that's basically why I'm so cautious and whatnot. I was drinking right then. I didn't really didn't think that through. You put the cap back on that. Oh Christ! Tree. Sin stench. Damn. At least my armor didn't die. There we go. Is the armor losing health there? Yeah, it is. Why would it be losing out? Did it have- Oh, it must have still had a dot on it. Oh, we'll kill this quickly and all will be fine. Move away from that. Come on, me. But yeah, it's basically- I'm very cautious with what I let's play. I make sure I can do so. Or I make sure I can let's play without getting warriors shoved up my arse. Uh, they like to go and roll. So, yeah, I like to- I like to be careful. Um, that's a boost to physical damage. That is a boost to socketed gold gems, or to dexterity. I have no idea what voice I'm doing. Um. Oh, hello, hello. Undying alchemist of anger. My side. My side, your side. Um. Uh, Thinking on dying of elemental resistance. Iron Slash. What? Any, uh, is it a relative of uh, Sand Slash? No beast of burden. I'd love to get a. Um, and, you know, put on the gold ring and, well, you know, upgrade a gold ring to a unique item. 
but I really don't fancy my chances of actually pulling that off. Need some help. So, so. So. So, so, so. No, what I've got is pretty good. Yeah. I'll talk about that stuff in a moment. Uh, I'll just get through to the warehouse because then they have a portal on that side and I'll uh, be able to talk then. I'm not a fan of these Souls Watchers. They're actually quite powerful with their blasts. So they do take up a bit of time, a wind up time. It's just I'm too lazy to move out of the way. <laughs> I tend to fixate and just try and brawl it down. Savage Undying uh, Grappler? Can I be honest? Why do they look like guys from uh, Killing Four? They make me think of the um, big burly guys with the gauntlets. Ah, oh. I played a bit of Killing Four before I actually recorded a bit. Not sure if it, I, not sure if it ever went live. I think it did, but brr. I, I have no idea, and I'm too inebriated to know off the top of my head. And I believe, yes, th this is where I am. Damn, it's not that bad spelling. I have no idea what that undying blockage is. Is it just a ton of the corpses coalesced into one? Uh, into a... Into a... Uh, singular being? Because if that's the case, why haven't we seen any other such aberration but more of a, a mobile sort of one? Maybe it was a unique um, situation. You know... Shit happens. And since we were going through a sewer, I'm sure there's plenty of shit here. Centuries old turds. I'm so I'm sure some archaeologists came on themselves with the thought of it. With the thought of that. Chest chest. Chest. Oh, bone offering. Um Consumes the corpse, granting all your minions the power to block both attacks and spells. This skill consumes all near, uh, uh, consumes other nearby corpses, increasing the duration for each corpse consumed. Uh, that's nice. That's a very useful, useful ability. Um, okay, if we go this way, beat these guys down. But yeah, uh, I would love to do um, that game at some stage, um, The Last of Us, and a sequel. I would love to do, but it will depend on Naughty Dog's policy. Uh, similarly, I would love to do the Jack and Daxter games, but that will also depend on Naughty Dog's policy. Uh, if they don't want me doing it, then I will, um, you know, I'll accept that. They don't want me doing it. I am no beast of London. So I, you know, I, you know, I'll accept it. You cunt! You absolute harlot! Um, but yeah, I'll, I'll accept it. You know, if they don't want to let's play, that's that's fine with me. That's no skin off my nose. I just wonder, are there any um, licensed music in the series? That's my concern. I I don't remember. Uh, what, what's it called? A primeval rapier? Uh, a primeval? It wouldn't be primeval. I I can't I can't I don't recognize the word. To see it? I, it's uh, well, I'm I'm swearing I'm mis IDing the word basically. I don't know the word. It's, I don't. Uh, I don't see that word enough in my everyday life to recognize it at the, at a glance. Superior callous mask. My God, that ma mask is just so callous. We told we told it its mother died and it just didn't care. It was just so callous. Uh, 
large physical damage aura. We do extra physical damage. Very nice. And here's the warehouse district, and I know the portal is down below. But... I want to keep going. I remember uh, just saying that I would want to way find the portal or something. But I'm just going to keep going. Foul bar. Blessing of Elements. Beast of burden. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, I think I'm going to stick with what I have. I do do more damage. Yeah. Yeah, I'll stick with what I have. Keep scarp. Uh, okay. Continued going. Surprising this stuff is in good condition as it is. But then again, that might just be the nightmare for you. And again, why isn't everything in good condition then? Colossal Boomstalker. Yep, join me. Join me or I'll hit your ankles some more. There's an item I need to get here. Oh, misclick, I didn't mean to heal. Uh, there's an item I think I either need to get here or somewhere nearby. Um, you know, like in the, some upground warehouse area. And I'm not sure, uh, like I said, I'm not sure if it's here or where, but I need to get it before I um, move on. Otherwise, I'm just going to have to come back for it. And I prefer not to have to do that. Well, the internet's been cooperating. Cue it stops. The sun starts acting up. You know, I think I might be on the right way. Why can't? I know this stuff is a bit randomized, but. It seems familiar, and I think it might be nearby. The Gem Gentile are an infestation. They are the Monkey King's pleas that drink of your lifeblood. Crush them in your work forged hand. Wait, Gentile. That makes me think of two separate words. And if it's one, then that's. Oh. Well, that word takes on a very the different meaning. Gentile are an what is that statement? They are the Monkey King's fleas that drink of your lifeblood. Crush them in your work forged hands. Ah, Gentile, it's. Uh, refined or polite, often in an affected way. Okay, th then that's completely different than what I was expecting. Well, to be honest, it can make me think of the word Gentile. Uh, not Jew, basically. And I was wondering, wait, what? <laughs> I was just getting words confused. Ooh, yeah. I was wondering, wait, what? What? <laughs> you know, what's going on? <laughs> Sectarian violence? Um, I know I was in the wrong place. Shit. Ah, uh, my hope... Oh, you know, my hope is dust. How many are there? Christ. I have no issue, they're all shit, but... Just, my god, there's a ton. Seriously. It's like a veritable army of them. I can see why they were too nervous to go anywhere. There, there is, like I said, a veritable arm. Yeah. We'll just keep dominating them. It will make my life easier. Though it will make it hard for some of them to, for, for me to actually see some of them amongst the crowd. At least the crowd will be on my side of mauling them. Shield charge? Ah, yes, 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 yes. I remember that. Never really used it. I think I used it a little near the start, but that was it. 
What's this? Um, not enough interest there. Okay, dying untouchable. Undying untouchable. Yeah. Rate, rate rips the supreme. What a name. Uh, actually, in crits. Alright, nice. Very useful. Okay. The one, the one poor bastard. Just get mugged there. Just absolutely mugged. Okay, we stride on into here. Oh, this place is holding up surpri again surprisingly well. Up surprisingly well. Smacking it around. Here's another burly one. Flame Walker the Tyrant. Extra cold damage, life regen. Allies deal extra physical damage and resist elemental damage. I am exceptionally happy at the sheer amount of enemies we're facing. Gemwing Legionnaire. I've never fought these before. These are names. They're like it's. Name the Ventec. Beat it down. Damn it. Uh, I'll go down and finish them off. Got put back a little because of that. Not really sure how much. On cruel difficulty, there is a XP penalty, but I don't know by how much. So it may be, you know, irrelevant, not worth talking about, or it may be the most relevant thing that you ever knew. Ceremonial kite shield. No, 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 no. Alright, let's just uh, retrace our steps and get the fuck back there. Um, this way. This is a show I miss forever. It's a good show. You follow uh, an immortal by the name of Henry Morgan. He's played by the guy who played Miss Fantastic in uh, the F Fantastic Four movie uh, with the Silver Surfer sequel. Um, he plays them. Um, official orders. He, he played that Miss Fantastic. It, you know, early 2000s Miss Fantastic. That, uh, that actor. He plays, anyway, he plays Henry, a br British guy, he's immortal, been alive for 200 years, I believe. Uh, but then again, maybe even think of Highlander. Um, and he is um, working as a coroner in New York, because he want, he studies bodies to try and figure out how to cure himself of his immortality. And he he wants to die, is the thing of it. And the like him trying to hide it, then there's another immortal that turns up. There's few people cursed with this, and the conflict there, because unlike Henry, well, uh, like Henry's actually quite a good guy. This immortal isn't. He's a bit of a cunt, um, and you know there's different, you know there's different drama, and you know it's it's it was actually the first show where I actually gave a shit, and like normally when the characters are you know getting making out or getting on, it's just like uh huh uh yes keep, get on with the plot. I was actually happy for him once, for, you know, for the, I was actually happy for the character. It's like, oh, that's good. You know, he's happy, you know? Because it was the first one I gave a shit about. Like, I remember watching Matrix when I was younger. Uh, maybe it was the age I was at, but I just, I, I, I you know, I was, ha like, I was watching the second movie with my mom, and I was just happy when she changed the channel for the 10-minute uh, sex scene. Maybe I'm exaggerating, but that's what it felt like. Um... And it's just like, you know, I was uh, basically, you know, for sure I was actually happy that, you know, forward characters' romantic efforts. 
It's like, ah, oh, good. So, yeah.